Hey guys. It's very bright out here. August. That's you, Daddy. Hi, Daddy. He says, too bright. Too bright to talk. Hey guys, welcome. I hope you enjoyed that little intro from my wife and my son. As you can see, they are quite silly individuals. But as we like to do here on Hardcore Home Improvement, we like to start off walking into the garage. You guys get an idea of what's going on. That's the new pressure washer I've been using quite a bit lately, trying to clean up the outside of the house, etc. Here's my dad working on some stuff. This is a very special episode of Hardcore Home Improvement because it's ultra long. And hopefully I'll be able to keep up and explain everything that's going on. So my dad there is pulling some nails out of some old boards. We do try to recycle whatever we can. And uh, here you're going to see us do some sawing and some cutting and some measuring. And anyone who's done any home improvement work or built a home, etc., knows that basically you measure not once, not twice, but like 17,000 times before you cut something that's important. Uh, but later on, you'll see some very expensive boards we were using. And I think I measured those at like seven or eight times before I actually, you know, ended up cutting them where I wanted to. So uh, regardless, it, you know, basically we've been doing lots and lots of work here. As you'll see, my dad and I are working. This is a uh, Gosh, I think we had 300 days of work in this video. So here's day one. Um, my dad's actually in Costa Rica right now. He's down there getting some dental work done because it's so much cheaper. And he's getting some major work done. Wants to get, you know, his teeth all fixed up. And decided that going to Costa Rica was it well a a good excuse to go to Costa Rica. And B, it was like a third of the price of getting the work done here. Which you know we're both home employed or home employed, self employed. So we don't have health insurance like most people do or dental insurance. You know we can't just go and get work done and paid for by our bosses because. Well, we are our own bosses. And believe it or not, the debt cost of dental insurance for a, a home business is ridiculous. So that was the day that he came out and worked, uh, gosh, it's probably a week and a half ago now. We didn't get a whole lot done, but uh, we did build the framing for a new door, which I'll show you that door here in a little while. It's much like the door to my left, but this is my brother, Joseph. You guys may remember him from uh, the Christmas video where we went shooting or the Dog Island video. There'll be links on the screen for both of those. And those were a lot of fun. Uh, you'll see here, this is the wall that we're cutting through right now. My brother James there is helping me out. He has been such an amazing help this whole project. Seriously, James is the man. Basically right here, we're trying to increase the space in the main living area. So we're gonna kick this wall out just a few more inches. We already removed over six feet of wall there on the left side. It had just a small doorway. There's me, pick up my pants. Pick up your pants, fool. I'm covered in sawdust. I'm trying to move this wall out. You'll see basically the whole goal here is to make a really free flowing kind of smooth feeling room. And it's coming together pretty well. I think right now we have maybe one more day of hardcore construction, uh, not counting the stairs we're gonna put into the upstairs area. And then we can start running electrical wire and insulation and drywall, etc. And I think the only thing we're not going to do is the drywall because I don't like doing drywall. It's messy, it's nasty. I've had very little experience with it and all the experiences have been bad. But here's a bad decision, rocking, walking underneath a ladder with someone else on it while carrying some long, heavy board. Not exactly the world's most brilliant decision, but what can you say? There's my Twitch TV shirt. Yeah, you know, you like it. You know you like it. <laughs> Went and grabbed the camera, brought it around here to show you guys James. Again, seriously, James has been such a help, even if he's an idiot and is currently trying to pull a blade out of a sawzall that's very, very hot. And my apologies for some of the dark video in here, guys. I was not on top of my video settings as much as normal because I was working my tail off. But uh, as you'll see here, those are some extra long boards. They had these 14-foot 2 bys in that just were not necessary. So we cut those off, and uh, we're doing what we can right now to kind of open up the space up there because that's where the bed is going to go. So here's the next day. Uh, my brother James and I went to Lowe's. And uh, hang on. Quick, uh, quick hello to Nell, I think, coming up in a second. Walking past the truck. That's all the boards. Lots and lots of boards. And here's my silly, silly wife once again. This will make you laugh. Here she comes. That's the longest boards ever. And uh, there, she, there she is. She's got back from her run. She's such a dork. I love her to death. Amazing woman. But uh, anyway, that's our load of lumber and screws and everything else. It's ridiculous how expensive screws are. We went, five pounds of screws is like 30 or 40 bucks. It's it's not cheap. It's just not cheap. But this is my brother Joseph eating some homemade pizza. And now they, he's back and we're putting in these pillars because our plan is to support the roof from pillars that go from the ground all the way back up to the ceiling and then have the entire everything kind of rest on those so we can remove some of the cross braces in the building to add uh, more open ceilings because we're putting a, a, a loft into this thing and basically putting a loft in changes everything 
and we make sure that we, we want to make sure that we have enough headroom. So as you can see here, here's the doorway my dad and I added, uh, and then James cut out the, the cypress there in the front end. This will actually be the doorway from the garage area into my shop, because eventually there'll be a wall right about where I'm standing right now between the living areas. Now you'll see Joseph and James up on top. They're screwing things in. And just so you guys know, I actually do work during these days. I swear I really do. Uh, I know that a lot of times you guys don't get to see me working because I'm the one holding the camera, but it's like maybe, gosh, this is, I think I got about 11 or 12 minutes of footage in three days of, of work. So if that tells you anything, I really do work. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'll be the first to say that my brothers and my dad are even better workmen than I am. Like they're, they're just experts. And I've, I've had my fair share of work opportunities, but they're epic. And uh, I love them for it. But this is the final, uh, the finale, the last little bit you got to see. And this is basically just to let you guys know what we did after that last day of work. We actually had a nice Brazilian barbecue, some caipirinhas, some picanha, venison steaks. I mean, just really good stuff. And if you guys know Brazilian food at all, you know that that is delicious. But guys, that was episode number four of Hardcore Home Improvement. If you'd like to keep up with what's going on and the latest and greatest things in these projects, I'll look forward to sharing more with you soon. And just to let you guys know, I think this week I'm going to go buy a motorcycle that we can start working on together. So I'll talk to you soon. Have a great day, guys. Bye-bye. <laughs>